The future of news is... Smart. Raw. Curated. Connected. Mobile. Global. The impact of technology on the economics of news is forcing us to find better ways to do it. We live in a media-rich global world. Revolutions are happening, markets are shifting, climate is changing. That's what news is. It's the answer to why on a global scale. In 2009, we partnered with the Bill and Melinda Gates Foundation to create something called ViewChange.org, a next-generation video platform. We took what we knew really well, which was powerful global videos, and we paired them with some cutting-edge technologies, things like natural language processing, which informs kind of a smart, intelligent search. These are the technologies that we're building on in this current work with the Bertha Foundation to create a mobile platform for global news videos. Video is the center of what we do. We pull from hundreds of different video sources, BBC, Reuters, Al Jazeera, and smaller local broadcasters, state broadcasters, and even individual users uploading raw video to YouTube. Well, the first thing you'll see is a dynamically generated list of relevant topics for every video. And this is where our natural language processing scrapes the video metadata and finds detailed information that's relevant to the video you're watching. If you really want to dive in, there are related videos and articles that are filtered from top news organizations, but using that same mix of curation but also intelligent processing. There's a real benefit to be able to see all those different perspectives to understand why people in different countries may have different ideas about what's going on. Right now we're experiencing one of those seismic shifts in the industry. People aren't looking for news only from official sources anymore. It's not just the ABCs and the CNNs of the world. More and more people, especially young news consumers, are turning to YouTube to find their news. And the amazing thing is that, what, a decade ago, YouTube didn't even exist. Now, every single minute of the day, 72 hours of video are being uploaded to YouTube. We're out there curating and searching that YouTube API for the best global sources. We do the heavy lifting so that you don't have to. This is the reason why we have uh, a team of journalists on staff is that we're doing uh, um, uh, cultivated news. Uh, and uh, this is kind of the evolving role of uh, what a journalist is, is uh, the editorial capability basically of sorting out good news from, from bad news. Social media, raw video, blogs, articles, documentaries, and the news ecosystem has gotten a lot more complex. We don't want you to have to go to five different sites to get all of the detailed insight that goes behind a story. We want it to be right there in front of you, just a tap away. We've created a powerful news platform, but what we're doing is much more than a set of product features. We're combining our passionate beliefs with the best technology. You know, we don't really know exactly where this all goes to next. We're not just following trends in this arena. We're, we're, we, uh, we want to be trendsetters. And so the way that we're doing this is to be able to actually get past some of the hype cycle and to find out what really works in terms of, of, uh, of modern journalism. In the final analysis, I think the future of news is whatever we decide it's going to be. And I think what we're making here is pretty great.